Hello everyone, this is Reza. In this short video, I will demonstrate how to remove a blend shape from your object. So this is the model that we worked on in Facial Rigging for Beginner series. And if you have studied that course, you know that by the end of this course, uh, we created a control for our blend shape and tied all our blend shapes to this control. Now, the thing is, these controls come from this blend shape one node, which encompasses all of our blend shape deformers. Now, how can we remove individual blend shapes without removing the blend shape one node from our channel box? Because as soon as we modify this, then every blend shape we have becomes dysfunctional. So you may say, well, why don't we go to animation and have a look at deform blend shape option box? You can see there is no option to remove individual blend shape. Now that's the idea behind this video. Now let's get started. Let's say we would like to remove disgust. Let's say for whatever reason, I'm not happy with this expression and I would like to remove it from my blend shape one node and subsequently from the control that I have. Now to do that, I need to bring the hidden blend shape node back. So all the target meshes are here and I need to find the one that I'm looking for. Then with that one selected, I go to deform and then all the way to edit blend shape, remove. And all I need to do is just to say, specify the node. I've got only one blend shape node, which is blend shape one. I can specify the target, which is the name of this geometry. As you can see, it's called BLND shape discuss your one. And then I go apply and close. Now, if I select the mesh and go to blend shape, you can see we successfully removed that particular blend shape. Now, all I need to do is to select the main control, go to discuss and edit and delete attribute. All done. Hide the group again and resume with my work. So that's how you remove an individual blend shape deformer from a set of blend shapes on your model. I hope you find this video useful and hope to see you in the next one.